Okay, so here's the process I go through to um, cut my DAL props uh, from 6 inch to 5 inch. Of course, I have the props. Those are the DAL 6 inch props. I have a 5 inch prop on here at the moment on this copter, so um, um, that I'll use to measure with. I have a nice cutter and uh, I have a prop balancer and a little piece of sandpaper. So uh, typically I'd uh, remove a prop from the existing um, machine. There it goes. Here's a prop. What I'll do next is I'll take one of these uh, six inch props, stick it on there, and I'll put the, the five inch prop upside down on top so um, now I have two props on there and uh, the next step is really just um, sliding from the outside um, the prop uh, the, the cutters until it reaches or a stop you'll see there exactly there's where it match or uh, reaches the the five inch prop and I'll cut and then I'll spin it around and I'll from the outside slide in again and that's where it stops and I'll cut. So um, this prop is now cut to five inches and um, I'll just take off uh, the little rough edges like this a little bit. Nothing too serious. And um, next I'll go through the the balancing process and that is you know as you know is fairly simple we'll stick it on one of these guys uh, normal prop balancer Oops. normal prop balancer there we go uh, it's all good there we go and uh, I'll look at balancing the prop. Of course in this case it looks like this side is heavier. So um, I'll just uh, sand some more off on that side. Let's see if we can get. Let's see how much out of balance it is. Yep, it's still quite a bit out of balance. So in that case I'll actually cut a little piece off more and I'll do my sanding trick to get the nice round edges there we go let's look at that again and it's looking better already that prop is pretty balanced already I'm just going to do a little bit of cleanup work and there you go, a balanced prop. So that's what I do. I can now, uh, of course, take this prop and uh, put that back on the copter. And now I have a, uh, a nice, um, much more efficient prop than, of course, the DIL 5030s. But this guy is... Um, now a, um, a really high lift 5 inch bull nose prop and um, there you go. So that's the process I take to get that done. Thank you.